In this session, we will cover how to create and load a paper key into your Datalink Scanner and Datalink Connect program. The easiest way to create a key is by making a paper key using a Datalink answer sheet. Make certain you are using the same answer sheet that will be used to administer the test to students. Bubble in the key bubble at the top left. If you want the correct answers to print on the student's answer sheet when they are scanned, then you will also need to fill in the verify bubble. If the verify bubble is not filled in, then when the test is scanned, only a red dash will show up next to the incorrect answers on the student answer sheet. Once you have marked in your key selection at the top, you will then need to fill out the rest of your key. Fill in all the bubbles or brackets that correspond with the correct answers for the test you will be giving. Note that by marking multiple responses for a single question, it requires the student to mark the exact same marks to get the answer correct. An either or option is only available when using an electronic key in the Datalink Connect program. You can save your paper key in electronic format that will allow you to have either or options, as well as align questions to standards and add subtests. To view how to add those features to your key, see our online tutorials in the Learning Center on Creating Electronic Key. After you have filled in all the correct answers and marked the key bubble at the top of your answer sheet, your answer key is ready to run through your scanner. If you want to capture electronic data when scanning your test, you will need to check that the scanner is connected to Datalink Connect. To do this, open Datalink Connect on your computer. Check to make sure your display is showing a green square at the bottom left. If you are seeing the green square and it says the name of the type of scanner you are using, you are ready to scan your answer key. If at the bottom left you have a dark black and red square, that indicates your scanner is not connected to the program. In this case, check to make sure the power supply is plugged into the wall outlet and the scanner. You will know the scanner is on when the LCD screen shows ready. Then double check that the USB cable is connected to both the scanner and your computer. To establish the connection, you will need to go to the top menu and click on Scanner and navigate down to Find Scanner. Your dark black and red button should then change to green indicating that your scanner is hooked up and ready to scan answer sheets. Once Datalink Connect is up and running in test scoring mode and is connected to your scanner, scan the key. The correct responses will be shown in Datalink Connect's blue key row at the top of the screen. Once the key has been scanned, it can be saved as an electronic key file and saved for future use or to share with others. On your paper key, you will see that the correct answer has been printed next to each row. If you had a question with more than one correct answer on that row, then a red X will show rather than the correct answer. This simply indicates that more than one response was selected for that question. We encourage you to make sure you verify the information showing in the Datalink Connect program is correct and contains the answers from the paper key you scanned. You can double check the information in this screen and edit as needed. If you have any additional questions on how to create or load a key into Datalink Connect, please contact a member of our technical support team at 800-827-9219.